Alola. And what's the chow chin chow? Strange PH Games here. Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Sun Lack of Internet Let's Play. In the last episode, we made it right. Uh, we got our sixth trial done. We got the Ghostium Z? The Ghostium Z, yeah, the Ghostium Z. We took a picture of a Tudum Mimikyu and it almost destroyed our team, so it did not want it it did not want its time to shine. It did not want us to take a close up. It did it was not ready we were not ready for a close up with this Pokemon. But we did it. We took it down eventually, thanks to Roderick. And today I am gonna be bringing onto the team just for the just for a couple of episodes, not entirely he's coming onto the team, but just for a couple of episodes, Shitoshi the Ashka Ninja is coming onto the team. Just for a couple of episodes, he's not being a full he's not gonna become a full member of the team, but he is gonna be coming onto the team here because I said I was gonna do it. I said I was gonna do it once we were leveled up to control him and we were leveled up around him, which we now are. It is time to bring Shitoshi onto the team. So, Ashkara Ninja, it is your time. Sadly, I cannot name you Shitoshi, but for all intents and purposes, you are known as Shitoshi. By the way, Shitoshi is Japanese for Ash, and this, since this is the Ashkara Ninja, it makes perfect sense. So, let's throw him into the front of the party. He's also holding the uh, Waterism Z, which is really good. And of course, also, I have gave the Insor, uh, the Inc I've gave Incineroar his unique Pokemon Stone too. So I can't wait to use that as well. Ooh, in there's some people here. Hello, Team Skull. Back so soon, huh? I wasn't expecting you back just yet. It seems like these dumb grunts are way, t are way too long to deal with you kids. So I guess it's my turn now. What? I told you before. Next time um, you get in our way, I'm not holding anything back. Alright, fine. Come on, Parmela. It is, it is time. Shitoshi's got this. I took up my electric type here, though. That's the annoying thing about this. And you have a gold bat. I took up my electric type in order to actually uh, uh, to do this, to bring on Ash Greninja. So, this is kind of annoying, but, like, it's time. Greninja, it's time for you, Greninja. So, I'm going to go for the Night Slash. That did about half. Nice. Really? This is not good. If you start hitting yourself, you're not showing me why I'm putting you on the team just for a couple of episodes. You're showing me exactly why only a couple of episodes. Like, you're making it like only a couple, very couple of episodes. Good. Nice. And Greninja's had a full bond with us, which means, in other words, it is time. Battle bond in effect. And here's Ash Greninja. You got a snazzle? Um, I don't care for your snazzle. I'm, I'm gonna keep battling. Right. Now I would really like to to deal with you, but the fact is I'm confused right now. So it's a good thing I have. Uh, I've been grinding up on their uh, Pearson Berries in the Pokepelago. So, I'm going to give myself a Pearson Berry. Snap out my confusion. Toxic's annoying, but I can heal that in Pokemon Refresh, so I don't mind Toxic. It's the confusion that's annoying. Because the confusion is going to stop me from killing things. Alright, do it, Greninja. Big water shurikens coming through. One more of those, please. Nice. Ooh, 
Water sh it's uh, with the water shurikens. Shitoshi proving why it deserves to be on the team. Sadly, it's poisoned though. I will take care of that. We will heal. We will rub this medicine all over its body. We'll put the uh, we'll put the Vix on his body, and there we go. There we go. You are nice and safe now that you have Vix. Now eat. And one more. There we go. He just gets us just as much care and attention as any other member of the team. Think of him as like the seventh member of this team right now. Hmm. I guess you're uh, still pretty tough. I underst now I understand why my grunts will wait uh, waste so much time battling kids. But if uh, but if you want us to return the Pokemon, then you'll have to just come with us alone. Our boss is dying to meet you. See you in our base in Po Town. Ugh, battles that you can't afford to lose aren't any fun. Hey, you guys okay? My young goose. We can't forgive this. Darn it! Those numbskulls actually did something pretty clever for once. If we want to get the Pokemon back, then Joe, you have to go to Potine all alone. No backup. That's what they said. If that's not, f but that's not fair. Team Skull have taken over Po Town. It's a, basically a private playground for for them. If you're gonna go and try and find, uh, uh, try and find this guy. If you're gonna go through, try to find this guy on Route 15. Who's wearing a kimono? He might be able to help you get to Po Town. Here, take this. Just get my young goose back for me. Hey, thank you for the rare candy. Oh, good. They didn't get Cosmog. They just got a, they just got a young goose. I mean, I don't really care for it, but they just got a young goose. They did not get Cosmog. I am a, I am glad that they did not get Cosmog out of this. I will go and help. I'm going to go and help now. Me and Shitoshi and Criminal... Wait, Criminal's in the box. Me and Shitoshi and Roderick and Sophie and... All the other members of this team are going to go and do the damage. That's what we're going to do. We're going to do the damage. We're going to stop these guys. We're going to do that this episode. I don't know if we'll do it. We'll do it through this episode and the next episode. Because we might... It might take longer than I think. That's an Alolan Sandro. Okay, so this is Ice and Steel type. I'm going to go for that Night Slash. Ion Defense. I do not like your Ion Defense. Not a big fan of the iron defense. Yeah, especially now that I can't kill you. It's going to take me more than a couple of hits to kill you. And activate my sh uh, activate my Ash Greninja powers. Oh, it's a free shot. Okay, fine. I'll activate my Ash Greninja powers here. 
Ashka Ninja powers activate. And that, that's not even level 37 yet. I'm going to keep battling. This is the Lolan Malwak coming in. I have the advantage. Being the Ashra Ninja, that, uh, being the ultra powerful Ashra Ninja, that's an advantage here. So let's do it. Water Shurikens. One more. Nice. There's level 37 for Astro Ninja. I should go and get them. On, I should go and get them on my other file too, because I have like I have like two files of the demo. One on my main DS and one on this DS. And this is and uh, the Astro Ninja we got is from this DS. So I need to go and do that with the other three, my other save files. Oh, Pelipper! Pelipper! Right. Astro Ninja, you good at helping me catch Pokemon? Or are you really bad at that? You're okay. You're okay at this. You're okay at this at the moment in time. Now, I want you to go for the area waste, and I don't want you to kill it. Want you to just put it in the red. Or at least yeah, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do. I can do stuff with that. One. Two. Three. Oh, come on. Yeah, fling, fling your pity, fling your pretty wing at me. See if I care about your pretty wing. Because I don't. One, two, three. There we go. We caught the toilet bird. Now, would I be allowed to call it that? And that's another evolution line caught. Nice. It's expanded for spa. It's expanded beak is uh, large enough to fit a small child right inside. Okay. Yeah, you and your small child keeping, ab uh, keeping abilities. I'm not so sure I'm coming anywhere near you with kids. That's all I'm saying, to uh, Pelipper. I'm not coming anywhere near you with kids. It allows it. It allows it. It allows me to call it Toilet Bird. you got to stop allowing me to do this game because I'm going to keep on trying to expose your system here. Because I'm, every time I see a Pelipper, it gets named Toilet Bird. And if, and I don't know, I mean, technically to myself, I don't think Toilet's a bad word, but like, it probably is a bad word. Hey, mate. Well, this guy we sort of know. So this is going to be rather interesting. Ooh, there's a Psycho Core here. Thank you. Now let's talk to this guy. Hmm. 
Man, oh man, what's going on today? Someone actually borrowed, actually bothered coming to this kind of sad place. Well, no matter. I'll take you on and keep you company. Tell me, Uncle Grimsley is going to flip a coin. Will it be heads or tails? I can choose heads, tails, or neither. Um, go tails. Astonishingly, you just took a stab at, like, some kind of profit. Right on. You and your Pokemon are shining brightly. A, a loss is a loss. I'll give you Sharpedo, who's info, into your ride pager. Ride it to victory. Sharpedo is registered in your ride fit. You're right, Phaser. Maybe you don't need to hear this from me, but I'm going to tell you it anyway. If you press B whilst riding Sharpedo there, you'll be able to smash through those rocks. Just, just like those ones over there. And here's a bit more of unwanted advice. Potown lies beyond uh, lies the, at the other end of Route 16, but it's fully occupied by Team Skull. You shouldn't go there unless you want trouble. Oh, believe me, Grimsley, I want trouble. I want trouble. I love trouble. Trouble is my middle name. It's actually not, but you know, it's the same. Uh, you know, you know what I'm trying to get at here, guys. I do not mind trouble, is what I'm trying to say. I do not mind a bit of trouble here and there. But I'm going to put on a repel. Where are my repels? And a super potion for Greninja. Because I can buy hypers now. I don't really need supers anymore, so I can just waste the supers I have. So, on Sharpedo, we can smash through these big rocks. Just like that. And we also go really, really fast when we push the B button, so that's really cool too. And uh, just like the uh, rocks that the Tauros can smash through, there will be, there couldn't be items. So that's really cool too. So just like the Sharpie, just like the rocks that uh, Tor our good friend Tauros can smash through, though we can, we can deal with people like that. It's awesome. We can deal with rocks now and it's awesome. There's a dive ball here. There's a lot of trainers out on this route too, and there's a trainer. Uh, there's a trainer gate as well, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try and pass through that trainer checkpoint and go see if I can beat all the trainers on this route off screen. I don't need to do that on screen. Hello, mate. Yep, I will run another repel. There's a TM back. Wait, hang on. There's a TM there. Oh, there's a crawl space. Okay, that's TM 81 X Scissor. Nice. I did not realize there's a crawl space back here. I did not realize there's a crawl space back here. There's a PP up. Hello. Oh, 
Okay, so these people are just looking at Spinda. Anyway, there's a l building right here, and this is very important because it's seen the Dexio. Hello. I've been waiting for you. Now, let me explain about this uh, reassembly unit. Senna, you don't have to. W uh, you don't waste even a second, do you? Since um, you've been collecting zygote cells and cores, you've collected uh, you've collected ten or more cells and cores combined. Anyway, I'll explain. The reassembly unit is a device uh, that has some. And thing to do with the Pokemon Zygarde. The Miss Machine is capable of assembling and separating Zygarde. Assembly is uh, to create a Pokemon called Zygarde. Now, Dexio, it's your turn. Oh, sinner, 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 sinner. Anyway, hey, there's two ways. Uh, there's two ways to assemble Zygarde. One is to add cores to the collected Zygarde that you may have had from Pokemon X and Pokemon Y. The other, uh, the other way is to collect a whole bunch of new Zygarde cores and make your own Zygarde. Next we'll explain about separation. To separate Zygarde it means to return Zygarde to its cells. Separated cells can be returned to the Zygarde cube. Now, for your information, according to your re according to a research done by the professor who sent who uh, spent time with us in Alola, Zygarde is divided up into a hundred cores and a hundred cells. It's actually divided up into ninety-five cells and five cores. Depending on the number of cells and cores, your Zygarde may take a different shape than it, uh, than it normally would. In other words, Zygarde can change its form. Zygarde is said to maintain the order of the, uh, of the Kalos region, so why is it here in Alola? Is that a sign of something that's about to happen? If you collect enough, if you collect Zygarde cores and cells, you may get your answer. Anyhow, we'll be taking our leave now. Bon voyage. So I have enough cells to do this. So let's do it. I would like to assemble using. Uh, the Zygarde cube only. Zygarde will be assembled using cores and cells from the Zygarde cube only. 10% is stored in the Zygarde cube and will assemble the Zygarde 10% form. Is this okay? Yes, this is okay. A new Zygarde has been assembled. It is Zygarde 10% form. Psycho on 10% form goes into a Pokeball. And just like that, I have a legendary. We have Zygarde Dog. Its sharp fangs make short work of finishing off its enemies, but it is unable to maintain this, uh, this body. And indefinitely, after a series, after a period of time, it falls apart. Um, I'm going to call you. Zydog. So let's take a look at Zygarde here. A Zydog is level 30 with Dig, Bind, Lands Wrath, and Safeguard with Aurora Break for its ability. 
I'd have to do some work, but I could definitely work with this. For now, I'm going to send it to the box. But I could definitely work with that, and I could put that on the team. If you guys want to see that, I might put it on the team later on. I can't ask, I can't say, like, if you guys want to see that, let me know in the comment section down below. But by the time you see this, I probably will be finished with this Let's Play. Because the fact is, I have no internet right now. The only thing that makes me... Uh, the only thing I want to do is record, because basically, well, it's the only thing that's keeping me sane right now. And that's why I keep on recording, because it's the only thing keeping me sane, and I need this. I need to keep on recording to keep myself sane. I have a Mimikyu. Yeah, I have a Mimikyu. Hmm, see? It's just like I said, it's going to be, re be a really scary Pokemon that is underneath that cloth. No one knows what's in there. Even if it's my job to, I can't just expect to come, uh, to come my scare, my survey scary uh, ghost Pokemon like that. I'll just copy the data from your Pokedex and submit it to my boss and call it a day. That's 20 grand! Tell you, these catching missions are amazing. I almost have 200 grand now. Thank you for the lemonade. Hello. Right. Citrus berry, yes, I can grow. I don't. I want to grow more of those berries. Asper berry, I want to grow some of those too. I've got pear sims. I don't need. I don't need any more pear sims. But citrus and asper, I do not mind growing some of those. I guess this is Po Town up here. Ah, this is the Ula Ula Meadow, actually. Okay, there's another photo. There's a photo spot around here. There it is. And there's our Pokemon. There's our area dose. Okay. There are certain, uh, there are certain uh, rocks here, that ch well actually not rocks, items uh, about that I want to uh, wanna get. Because round about here you find an uh, Unicorio, and the Unicorio around here is Unicorio Fire. Which is different from the Unicorio, uh, the Unicorio we have in the Pokedex right now. So we have Unicorio Electric. Every Onicorio is completely different, and that's really cool. You know what? I'm going to make it up to Po Town today, and then in the next episode, we're going to take on Po Town. That's what we're going to do. Nice work, Greninja. There we go, so we got some red nectar.
We'll face this girl and then we'll and then we'll go and continue on. Alright, what do you got for me, girl? You got two Pokemon. You start off with a Sneasel. Okay. I think Water Shuriken's the best move I got here, so let's just go for it. Does nothing, doesn't it? Yeah, it does nothing. Screech. Okay. I think I should probably switch out here. Beat up. That should hit twice, right? Yeah, hits twice. Okay. Rock slide. Go. Nice. Nice work, Roxy. And a Kamala. Now, in I was doing a little bit of grinding off screen, and Woody actually learned the move. I keep on saying that Woody could learn. I keep on saying that Woody could learn Bullet Seed, and it has to learn Bullet Seed now. So we know Bullet Seed. It's really cool. But the move I want to go for is Brick Break. Sucker Punch is annoying, but the move I really want to go for is Brick Break. There we go. Nice work, Woody. I'll face all the other trainers off screen from Route 16 and here. Uh, that's uh, the meadow as well. Yo, I'm a grunt, but I'm not good at fighting, yo. But no one wants to pick fights with me as long as I'm in Team Skull, you know. I want to pick fights with you. This is a police station, but now it's just a cat place. It seems like you've just collected another Zygarde core. Each core remembers moves of a mem uh, memorized by Zygarde, so you can teach your Zygarde as many moves as uh, moves as many times as you like. Everything is up to you. Born a chance. Cool. Everything is up to me. It's just a cat house now. Is that place? It was a police station, but now it's just a cat house. Uh, there's there's some rocks up there, which is kind of uh, which is interesting. There's stuff up here. Uh, item items of lemonade, nice. What can we find around Potam? Fero, I already have one of you, and I don't need another one of you. Thank you very much, game. Run. Run from the Fero. I miss a full heal. Nice. And what else can I find in this grass? A Lolan Graveler! Interesting. Hey Greninja, can you like... Okay, yeah, you're gonna kill it. Yeah, I kinda thought you would. I kind of thought you would kill with uh, that move. Of course, it's rain boosted and everything, so yeah. Uh, I see that. I 
we're going to have to face uh, a few of these grunts to get to where we need to go, which is the uh, Po Town. So in the next episode, we're going to take down Po Town, but we're going to get to Po Town in today's. We're going to get to Po Town in today's episode, and then in the next episode, we'll go through Po Town because off screen, I am going to do some. I'm going to do some grinding and face all the trainers off screen. I don't know if I need to do any grinding, but I just like to do. I just like to face trainers. When I've gone through a couple of routes, I like to go back and face trainers to clear routes out. Because I'm always one of those people who likes to have uh, to clear routes out. I'm just one of those guys who likes to clear routes. Well, so when it comes to nuzlocks, for example, I always make sure that I clear the routes before I advance on. If I can, that is. There is a, some kind of blockade going up. I need to get to it. So this episode might just be a bit longer, just because I wanted to get to there. Radada. And a Lolan Radada. I trust you, Greninja. I trust you can do stuff against an alone rather there. Oh, so close to activating your Astro Ninja powers. I'll put my evasiveness. No, you still see me. Ow. I guess that doesn't count as me killing it, so... My Ash Greninja powers don't activate. Recall does not count as me killing it, so... Yeah, my Astro Ninja powers do not activate, which is kind of annoying. I'm just going to keep on Water Shuriken. Hopefully I can get past this Radicate without losing Greninja here. But I might lose... I might... Greninja might go down here. Unless I hit, like, five times. No, Greninja's going down here. Ooh, the ninja stays around. I might just be able to get this. Nice. So I'm learning you've got to make sure you can kill. Or you actually kill. Potion for Astro Ninja. And we're at the door. Yo, what's up? You want to join Team Skull? Yo, is that a Z ring on your hand, y'all? For real, y'all? No, oh, you're actually on an Allen challenge? All right, then. Mm. I get it. Come through here to laugh at us losers and give up on your who gave up on that Allen challenge, huh? You showed up so suddenly uh, and got the, and got the ner uh, the got and got the nerve to laugh at me. It's hard to do that voice and uh, read at the same time. It's a really hard voice. And I give, I know like, I know it's a generic voice, and I know I give the same voice to males and females, but it's really hard to, you know, it's really hard to do that voice in the first place. It's really hard. I feel like that's just the standard team skull voice, whether you're a male or a female. It just that is the standard team skull voice. And that's where it will always be. It's a standard team skull voice. Right.
Let's do that. Night Slash from the Greninja. Nice. Uh, Ash Greninja powers activate. I don't really feel like I need you, Astro Ninja, just yet, but, you know, it's cool that you're here and all. Level 39 for Astro Ninja. Faint attack coming in from uh, Sophie. Down goes the Drowsy. Sophie goes to level 40. And we take out the blockade. Yo, no fair. I hate strong kids like you. I'm not letting you in. You fair boy. Seems to me you're trying to get into Po Town. You sure you you sure have got through You sure you've got through uh, this though? You better be ready if you're thinking of coming in here. Ready to uh, live as Team Skull or take on Team Skull. You really think you're ready for that? I am. I guess everyone's got their own reasons. I got my reasons too for doing what I do. I'll have to let them in. I'll have, I'll have them let you in. But if you don't make it, I'll be... I'll be uh, sure to leave your make sure your remains get her back home. Yo, what's this numb skull doing here? Or oh, what? Uh, what should we do? Forget about it. We got this barricade. I mean, we got this barricade. Do you really want to bother moving it out of the way? E, just so we can take on this kid? True, true. Go home, go. You're not coming in, Guarded. Well, not unless you find some path to go through here. Well, this is uh, going to be interesting. We've arrived here in Potown, and we've got ourselves a little bit of a blockade. But we're going to end off today's episode right here in Potown. In the next episode, we'll be taking on Team Skull in Potown and just taking back that Zyungus. But if you enjoyed today's episode, you can leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Till next time, y'all, I'm Joe's PH Games, y'all, and I'm out. See y'all again, y'all.